Hello, um, I'm Ryan V. I'm going to show you something very quickly I've been creating. Um, I'm going to try to explain about it while I'm doing it. Um, well, let's first just so, uh, show it. I'm for trying to create an IRC client which supports DCC for Android. And yes, it's already out there, it's in the Play Store, but I wanted to focus something, create something that focuses on the downloading part instead of the chat part. Um, so I've done that. It's it, it works, it's finished, uh, no, it's not finished, it's work in progress, it's really pre-alpha state, uh, but it's working, but it can crash, it can run slow, it looks ugly, uh, especially the downloading vanishing uh, part, which I really want to get focused on, but there was another problem that I faced when downloading uh, XCCC on my phone. Um, when I tried to search packages for our, uh, uh, on the internet, the websites that let me allow to search for them uh, weren't built for Android and smartphones alike. So when I tried to just copy the comments, the whole window get messed up and I, I don't know even know what happened then. Um, it annoyed me so much that I thought I should make something that's actually working on the phone. And that's what I've done. Um, I've created an IRC client and a website which lets you search packages way more easier. And it has another special feature which I'm going to show you right now. Otherwise, this is going to take way too long. Um, the website is ecxcc.tk. I don't have a really good web. Ho I don't have a web host actually. This is just a free web host that I'm using. It's slow, as you can see. Holy shit, it's slow. Uh, it shows the currently airing anime and such. Um, there are some totals with it. You can read it on the about page, uh, which I'm not going to uh, do right now. Um, but of course, I want to show you something that I want to show you the download. I want to show you the progress, how to do it. If you just type in, oh caps. Type in the name of the anime. Or yeah, th uh, I really forgot to talk to you about that. This one is only for anime right now. I'm going to expand it with other uh, sources as well, but for now, anime only. Um, you type in the anime you want, uh, you get the list with episodes. You can't see the bots, you can't see how big they are, you can only see the name of the file. And I'm going to change that as well, but just wait for it. Um, let's just select an episode we want to down. Let's say la 31, because it's 31. You get the normal layout, you can uh, select the comment, um, but normally you have to just select this comment, um, close the browser, open your IRC client, connect to us at the server and the channel uh, where the bot resides. Uh, is that the correct word for it? I don't know. And then paste this comment and then the download would start downloading. And that's a lot of steps to actually uh, get the file. And I'm like, I want to that can be done quicker. And I've created something like that. It's like he oh it's like here, this button, open. I didn't have give it a good enough a name. But if you click on it, it opens my application, uh, connects to the server, connects to this, uh, the uh, channel, and hopefully it work works. You get this a uh, lot of messy, messy things. Um, well, I'm going to make this look nice, nicer in the future, but still. It's just for testing purposes right now. And if you scroll down, you can actually see it's downloading. So if we go to the download page, because that's what we are talking about, downloading, you can act. holy shit, that's not what I want. I actually pressed my button twice. You can see the download is starting, holy smokes. Anyway, you can see the download is starting to download, obviously. And this is the download manager, which is ugly. You can see this is a lot of white text. It's, hurt my it's hurting my eyes. Um, I'm going to, of course, fix this. Um, but one thing I really like about XCCC and why I created this is because you can start actually playing the episode while it's downloading. As you can see. Fine, young man, eat. This place is known for its tasty vice first. Mm -hmm. it's mm -hmm, I don't care. But um <laughs> you can just start playing the episodes directly after the download and you just have to press one button. I uh, actually two now. Um you have to press the da the open thingy on the web side and go to the download step and open the file. And I will make that automatic as well. So if you just op press open on the tab that I was on the browser that I was on, just this, this button, it will automatically open the file and start playing the file after the download starts. But we are not that far yet. Well, that's actually it. Um, this app is work in progress, like I said. it's. You can't start another download after you open the app. You, s you can do it how you want for now. Um, 
yeah that's the only problem that I'm having with it and for for the rest it's just working that's it <laughs>